If you're looking for the stars near Earth, there is a wide variety of them. But if you're looking for the closest giant star, it's Pollux. And its name is often taken with another bright and quite similar star named Castor. Now, they are both in the constellation of Gemini and they look quite similar. So similar that the early stargazers came to call them about as twins. Now, in Greek mythology, they were both one of the Jason's Argonauts. Now, the famous journey led by Jason with another 50 great warriors in a quest to find the golden fleece in his ship named Argo. So, here's everything you need to know about Pollux. Entry. Now, this voice of Jason and his Argonauts is one of the greatest stories in the Greek mythology, in which Jason gathered about 50 greatest heroes or the demigods of the Greek world, and he just brought them together on a ship called Argo, in which two of them were Castor and Pollux. Now, by most references, they were the sons of Leda, which was a Spartan queen. But Castor had a mortal father, so he was a mortal. But Pollux, on the other hand, was son of Zeus and was immortal. But Pollux also had a famous sister, the Helen of Troy. Now, what happened by most accounts is that the caster died in a battle and Pollux just couldn't stay without him. So he went to Zeus and asked him to kill him too or to just make him die. But Zeus, as since Pollux was his son and he was immortal, just couldn't grant it. But he agreed on that Pollux would spend his remaining days, half of the days with gods here in Olympus and the other half in the underworld with his brother. And in the honor of the Pollux devotion, Zeus put the constellation in the sky as remembrance. Now this was the story related to the Pollux and Castor. But how do you find it, this in the night sky? Well, in order to find it, you can take the reference of another famous constellation, the Big Dipper. And if you have managed to find that in the night sky, you can just draw a straight line in the direction of the Big Dipper and then you will come across two bright stars. One of them would be Pollux and another would be the Castor. So now you have arrived in the Gemini. And for the coordinates gang, it's about right ascension, 7 hours, 45 minutes, 19 seconds and declination of about plus 28 degrees, 1 minute and 34 seconds. As I told you, it's one of the closest stars to Earth, it's just 34 light years away from Earth. And its mass is about 2 times that of the Sun, with radius about 9 times that of the Sun. It once glowed as a type A main sequence star, but since then it ran out of hydrogen in its core, it became a giant. Under the classification of K03b, where K0 means that it is somewhat cooler than our Sun and has a color of slightest yellow orange. The 3 here is the luminosity class, which tells us how much energy you are putting out there. It depends on the size of the star. And type 3 is the category of giant or a normal giant. And finally, the B indicates that Pollux is slightly below the average of this class of star's luminosity. Now we have also discovered a planet orbiting Pollux and it is about 2.6 times the mass of the Jupiter. Now it has been named Thestius by the International Astronomical Union. Now Pollux is also named Beta Geminorum, where Beta is usually uh, called out for a star which is the second brightest in the constellation. But that's not the case here because Pollux is the brightest star and Castor is the second brightest. Now this is similar to what happens in Orion constellation with Regio and Betelgeuse. Now the possible explanation for this is that when Johann Baer observed them about 300 years ago in Germany, they might have decreased their brightness still. Now another possibility is that when Baer observed them about 300 years ago, he named them and classified them in order of their rising, where both Castor and Betelgeuse both just rise first in the latitude of Germany. But there is a geographical dependency here and for some region south of the equator, the Rigel and Pollux rise first. So I hope you guys liked the video, smash like, hit subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye and check out more other star videos.